Hi guys. De Paris n'importe moi, moi sûr. Oh, j'entends des chansons. So in the last couple months, I've been cleaning up my closet, just like everyone else who was isolating. Um, and I realized a lot of the stuff that I had in my closet, I wasn't wearing. And it was because it's either not my size anymore or a style that isn't something I love anymore. So I decided that I would try selling my clothes. And so my first thought was to go to one of those stores where you can take in your clothes and they'll buy it, um, select pieces, and then they sell it to their customers for less than what shops sell it for. But that didn't go quite to plan. So then I thought, well, I could try Depop, I could try Buns, um, but I've tried these apps before and I never really have much luck. So I put it out there on Instagram and I asked my followers if they'd be interested in a stories closet sale because I had seen a few of the women that I follow putting up things on, for sale on their stories um, and they seemed to be pretty successful. And to my surprise, people actually want to buy my clothes. So I decided that this weekend I would do a stories closet sale. They seem to be pretty successful, but it's different for everyone. Everyone has a different following, everyone has a different closet. So we'll see what happens. I'm going to take you guys along for the ride with me, and you can use this as your point of reference should you ever do a stories closet sale. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Rochelle. I am a blogger and content creator over on Instagram. I post about thrifting, vintage style, normal everyday life stuff. I would love it if you went over and gave me a follow on Instagram um, and feel free to subscribe to me here on YouTube. Maybe that will encourage me to post a video more than once every six months. Tonight I'm going to be getting myself a little bit more organized, um, steaming some of the things that are wrinkly and taking pictures of those things before they get wrinkly again. I really don't know what I'm getting myself into. So this is a little preview of what's going to be included in the sale tomorrow. I realized I have a lot more to sell than I had anticipated, so this will be interesting. Um, I do have some pieces um, that my mom um, actually gave to me to sell years ago. And I never got around to it. So hopefully I'm going to get those sold during the sale as well. And then I have these pieces that um, have been in my closet for a while that I just don't wear. So hopefully they'll find new homes. to steam the pieces and take some photos. But I ended up talking to my brother on the phone for an hour and by the time we hung up it was dark out, which is not ideal for photos. I wanted the natural light. So I didn't get any of that done. I did steam stuff. Um, but I'm going to start taking photos now and hopefully get all of that organized um, so that I'm not scrambling while people are like trying to buy stuff. I feel like I'm maybe overthinking this, but I just really like organization. So I'm going to drink my coffee and I'm going to take photos of things and I'll check back in when it's time to start the sale.
need to go in and post them and add the pricing. Um, so hopefully this goes well. But I'm excited to hopefully sell some stuff. And one thing I didn't mention in here yet, but I mentioned on my stories, is that I'm going to be donating 10% of the proceeds to Black Women in Motion, which is a Toronto nonprofit. Um, and I'm looking forward to being able to support them. Um, so hopefully we raise lots of money today. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and post the closet sale rules that I created. Um, and I guess here we go. Alrighty. Okay, so everything is posted on my stories at the moment. Um, now I'm just sort of waiting. So far there seems to be interest from two people. Um, so we'll see what that turns into. Update. I sold this dress. Made my first sale. And um, yeah. Sunday and I managed to sell three items today from the closet sale. Um, I was hoping to sell more of course but I am glad because I ended up making more money off those three items than I did um, with 13 items at the shops I mentioned earlier. Um, so that's great for me but also because I am donating some of the proceeds to a cause I care about. So. Um, it's a win-win. I'm glad these items are finding new homes. Um, I am going to be leaving my items up in my highlights on Instagram in case anyone was trying to make up their mind or didn't see it in time. So hopefully I'll make more sales off of that. Um, but overall, I think it was successful, but I didn't need to do as much prep and organization as I did. But that's just me. That's just how I do life. Let me know what your experience has been if you've done a closet sale. I'd love to know um, whether it's been on Instagram, Depop, Poshmark. Um, I am thinking about re-downloading those, so let me know in the comments. And thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video.